Okay, last time we played a little Cold War Zombies for Firebase Z's second anniversary, and you guys showed a lot of love on that video. So to kind of fill the gap until Season 2 comes out for Modern Warfare 2, uh, I'm gonna be playing a little more Cold War Zombies. And maybe I'll just sprinkle it in here and there as, you know, Modern Warfare goes along just to appease you guys that like this kind of content. But today we're gonna be doing something that I haven't really done too much in the past. We're gonna be playing some Outbreak Survival and seeing how far I can get. All right, here we go. Starting on the worst Outbreak map out there. But we do only start with a 1911 and our health does not regen. So I did have a tough choice here on what I wanted to use for my field upgrade. And uh, I chose Tesla Storm. I know what you're thinking. Why don't you just use uh, healing or, or, you know, anything else? There's, there's a ton of different options that could work here, but I think Tesla Storm is probably going to be my best bet trying to, you know, stay alive. Because healing aura, sure, it's going to give me some health back when I don't have any. But Tesla Storm can actually save me in a tough situation. And I can use stims. Stims are a good replacement for healing aura. Oh, armor. Perfect. Beautiful. We need that. And MP5 to start. Let's go. Now, I don't know what it is. It feels like zombies, like culturally has made a resurgence uh, i started watching the walking dead again after like years of not watching it i was pretty heavy into it when i was younger and stopped watching around like season nine or whatever i don't even know how many seasons are in the show anymore but i started watching it again with my girlfriend and now uh there's been the last of us show to come out which i'm gonna be watching soon and a lot of like old easter eggs from the zombies games or easter eggs that previously were unsolved have been solved so it seems like there's a whole lot of zombie stuff going around right now and it gets me a little more excited to play this but this is only gonna get more difficult so i'm gonna try to do all the events i can on at least the first few of these uh little outbreak surges i think they're called worlds i don't even remember to be honest rounds is what we can call them but on, on these first few rounds i'm gonna be trying to do as much as i can to get as loaded up as i can just to make sure that we can get as far as possible my goal is at is at least to get into the double digits it might be a little tough concerning my track record with being a, a buffoon an idiot but we'll try it but we're gonna try we're gonna do our best don't be a mimic thank you what we got in here oh the grapple gun is so fun though i really want to pick it up just to have fun with it but i know i'm gonna need the stim later so this is self-control coming into play and sorry 1911 i'm gonna leave you on the ground so there is no map in this the map is completely censored out basically glitched out so i don't really know what events we have unless i go up to each of them so i know we have the black chest event right over here the classic on this map Do we have a gold chest event somewhere sometimes it spawns over here let's go check i am not seeing it oh we have the radio Let's do that. Spawn in that HVT. Let's go get them. Oh, they got Hellhounds with it. Oh, it's a Panzer, of course. They're throwing as much fire at me as they can, dude. And just for the sake of this, I know that I can apply custom blueprints to whatever weapons I pick up, but I don't think I'm going to do that. Seems a little cheap for this because I could literally just go grab whatever gun and just put on the most like OP blueprint. Let's see what perk we get. Oh, mule kick. Kind of helpful, I guess. I, get, I mean, with, with ammo definitely helpful having three weapons though not really what i'm looking to have but why not let me get this m60 just because this will be a long range option but for the longest time I, I was pretty burnt out on cold war zombies so i think if i do a little bit at a time i don't i don't try to push myself i just play it every once in a while we should be fine because i want to get to the point where i get sick of this game again i want to take it slow but also i don't have that much health does the food stay on the ground after it drops or is there a timer to it Okay, we still got some food over here. Give me those bananas. Okay, we don't have the Dragon D's event over here. What's our third event? Is there no Wonder Fizz? Did I take that out of this? Oh, that only shows up when the beacon's over here. I'm getting my wires crossed. That's right. The Wonder Fizz is over here on this boat. I might need to go use that. I want to get Jug and Quick Revive as soon as possible. What up, zombie? Got my face. Give me this loose change. And give me Jug. Are they throwing shit at me? Knock that off. Why don't you jump down here and come get me? Oh, you know what? Since it is playing the death perception music, that would be a good perk to get too. Getting as much scrap as I can to level up my weapons and be able to buy some kill streaks would be nice. On top of that, it'll outline everything I need to do. Death perception is actually pretty clutch for outbreak. Oh, wait, there is a Dragon D's event. It's right there. I, I ran right past it. So give me death perception just because the music's playing and we we're just talking about it. I forgot how sick the operator skins in this game are too. This is so sweet. This is like the best tier 100 battle pass skin I think COD's put out. It's just so vibrant. And it's like my exact colors. All right, let's try the Dragon D's. Go ahead and get fed. Almost there. He's almost full. Stop hitting me. Knock that shit off right now. Oh, there's a Mangler. 
Oh, he just took himself out, idiot. Oh, no, wait. Maybe that was the event ending. Either way, who's still alive and kicking it? Me. What we got in here? Nothing crazy. Let's do our main event. And then once we're done with this, we can go ahead and try our black chest event. Those ones are always risky to do. I used to always use those to grind up like weapon XP just because of the sheer amount of zombies that spawn. But in this, with no health regen, I will be taking so many hits. Now we just need to defend this bad boy for three minutes. Okay, the hellhounds can stop. That's one thing we can go without. We don't need all this fire here. Okay, all right, all right, chill, get off me. Okay, big problem with this is when I go to try to pick up food, I'm picking up random objects on the ground. I just want to heal up. Okay. Whew. That was a little more difficult than I'd like to admit. But we made it through. And we got the money for it. Okay, let's open the anomaly real quick. We don't need a pack-a-punch because we're about to get a pack-a-punch chalice if we can complete this black chest event. It'll be very embarrassing if we don't. Oh, let's get speed call out. I feel like that's going to save our life. We'll get our field upgrade faster and just the reloading faster in those clutch situations is going to be very helpful. Let's get out our M60 because we have to be ready to take out these orbs. All right, here we go. Let's start with this one. Okay, we took it out. Did we? No, I got the red hit marker. All right, there it is. That's what we needed. Then we're just going to run Tesla Storm and try to take out the rest. There we go. That's two orbs. Okay, a little easier than I thought so far. Let's knock on wood, though. We don't want to ruin this. All right, last orb. Come on. Did we break it? Oh, we did. Easy. Way easier than I thought. And I think the weapon I'm going to be pack-a-punching is this MP5. I seem to be using it the most here. It's got the most speed for us and the most damage. Ooh, there is a gallow, though. The gallow is so much better. But we'll have another chance to pack a punch. I think the MP5 is more well-rounded. We'll grab that. Can you guys stop throwing shit at me? These guys got cannons, though. I'm not going to lie. All right, we've done absolutely everything we can. Oh, have we? Okay, let's add an ammo mod to this. Shatter Blast is probably our best bet. And I don't think we have enough to buy another perk. I think we're going to be short. Yeah, we need about 300 more points. That's all right. We'll do it next time around. Time to warp. Okay, we made it on over to Ruka. This one feels the most survival themed. And I think since we are pretty set up, I think Pack-A-Punch 1 can get us through pretty far. Uh, I'm going to try to speed through these. Like, I'll, I'll do events if I come across them. Like, if I see Orda, I think I have to try to take him out. But besides that, I'll just be going after stuff like this that falls in my lap. Quick little gold chest event. Okay, maybe this isn't as good as I thought it was going to be. I forgot how fast it scales an outbreak. Outbreak round two is like round base round 20. Oh, well, we got a hand cannon. I'll take that. And that should be our chest. Give me something good. Yeah, I didn't want to listen. They didn't give us anything good. Oh, dual Diamantes, though. We could have just the power class. The MP5, the Gallo, and the Diamantes. Oh, I feel like I want to keep the N60, though, for range. Sorry, Diamantes. Gonna have to leave you here. Did find a Wonder Fizz, though. So I can finally get that next perk. Let's get a Quick Revive, just because. We're gonna need that faster health regen and the ability to get back up. Next, I think we're either getting Stamina Up or Elemental Pop. I think those are the two that we need the most. Top in the weed car and get out of here. Oh, that's convenient. The one hellhound I ran over dropped a nuke. All right. What's this? Secure the terminal. Where is it? We have to wait for him to land? I forget. Oh, yeah. Here they come. All right. Let's fill this bad boy up. This area is just giving me legion nightmares. By every time that thing just fucked me up. And this one's filled. What's my reward? Oh, brain rot. Let's get that on a gallo. Oh, these guys are messing it up. Leave it alone. All right. We got it. Let's go. Give me my reward, please. Thank you. What is it? Oh, lame. All right. Open up the beacon, a little anomaly. Where is the armor stand? Because we need to upgrade this now. There we go. Be a lot safer. And we're going to pack a punch this gallo. And before we dip out, there's nothing more survival than a little fishing. Maybe we can get a ray gun from this. I'll, I'll do three little reel backs. Okay, armor. Not bad, but not great. Can't use it. And a boot, which is a mimic. So far, so good. Last one. Oh some points basically nothing we do have enough for another perk so let's get uh stamina up and we're out of here does this still work oh it does let's go might have screwed myself over because i don't have the best stuff here but we'll be skipping a few rounds okay uh we only skipped the four so it's actually not as bad as i thought and we're over here on zoo one of the better outbreak maps in my opinion is Orda patrolling this neighborhood i don't think he spawned in over here today and this is kind of struggling a little bit uh, maybe I shouldn't have skipped. Oh, and a Mimic? Come on. That should not take every round of my Gallo to kill a Mimic, especially when I have the ammo mod that's super effective against him. I'm in a little bit of a pickle here. I guess we'll do this. Come on. Go ahead and spawn in that HVT. All right, Panzer. I'm using the hand cannon on you. 
Okay, all right. This is looking a little rough here. And let's use Tesla Storm and let that kill him. Okay. Elemental Pop. Perfect. That's the perk I was going to buy next anyways. All right, let's start our main objective here. Let's see if we can do this. Oh, we have to bring the canister all the way back. I forgot about that. I might need to try to upgrade this really quick. Weapon. Blue. That's all we're getting. Back out, back out. Oof. Okay, we got a brain rotted zombie. You're going to defend me, buddy. Eat my field upgrade. This gallo's not doing the job anymore. Seems like none of my weapons are. But you manglers can eat my field upgrade. There we go. First one's in. Now we just need to do that again. Okay, manglers, eat that. Oh, sharpshooter with the MP5. Look at me. I need to wait till I have the field upgrade for this thing to make it safe enough for me to put this in. There we go. Pop it. Throw it in. Our main event is done. Clean. I need to pack a punch this thing again. Pack one is not doing it. There we go. All right, maybe we hit the box one time just to see. Wonder weapon, please. Nope, it's the bullfrog. Might be better than this. Okay, maybe one more time. The RPK. All right, whatever. Okay, any other perks I can get? Let's get PhD. Deadshot would be nice next. That way I can do that boosted critical damage. It's not really going to help out my aim since I am on keyboard and mouse right now, but it's whatever. Can I upgrade this at all? No. I could try to reroll the attachments. Let's try it. Nope. Nope. Zombie. No. Both of you guys need to leave. Let's, let's keep trying. It seems like it keeps giving me the same thing. All right. We might be coming out of this worse off than we, we started. Let's move on. Can I do this still? Oh, I can. I can move on even further. Sick. Give myself a little bit of a challenge. Okay. We are on Duga now, I think. And we have a holdout round, which is scary. I feel like I need to get this to pack three, but I don't know how I'm going to get 30,000. This gold chest might help out. Yeah, let's see if we can do it. Because this is wave six now. These zombies are significantly stronger. Oh, yeah. Way, way too strong for me. Holy shit. How many elites are they going to send at me at once? Brain rot, I need you to go crazy right now. Or shatter blast, either one. Ooh, brain rot of the disciple. That's what I like to see. Oh, an insta kill. Beautiful. Come on. I know you want to die, Panzer. I know you're just begging. Oh, shit. I haven't even scratched the surface of his health, I don't think. Oh, there we go. The tomahawk did it. Look at him just eating these. This guy is just a bullet sponge. There we go. Finally. Oh, the thumper? You best believe I'm picking this up. Give me that. Oh, it's the M79. I forgot. This gun is OP. With PhD, we're going to be surviving forever. All right, we need this Pack-A-Punch like now. Now, do I remember where Pack-A-Punch is on this map? I know with the beacon, it's like right here. Is it on top? Pack-A-Punch, are you up here? Pack-A-Punch, sweetie? I could have swore it was up here. Maybe it's on the other one. I guess we can check. Oh, it is. I did remember right. Let's go. Let's get that packed. Let's throw Shatter Blast on him. Probably. That's probably the best bet we have. And I'm going to go check to see if this black chest event is in one of these normal areas. I'm pretty sure it's like over here that it can spawn in this range. Because on round six, we might be able to get a pack a bunch too, Chalice. Oh, it's a helicopter. Can I hit this? Oh, I did a little bit. Oh, that did good damage too. Perfect. M79 already coming in clutch. Please have a death machine in here. No, but we do have a bow, which is very, very good. Because this bow is a one-shot kill on basically everything if you melee with it. At least that's how it was last time I played. We'll see if it's still the same. Is there a black chest event out here? Not that I see. All right, well, if the black chest event isn't over here, I think this is the only other spot that I can spawn on this map, then we might just have to go into the holdout round because I don't know if I'll be able to find the other events. But is it over here? don't look like it all right guess we're gonna have to try it okay let's hop in so we just have to stay in here for three minutes yikes oh my lanta this does nothing took a whole clip to take out one armored zombie pack two on the shotgun don't even help we're gonna have to use this this still one shots can i pet you yeah okay, so far so good we survived for a minute now i can just walk around doing this what? What? I forgot about abominations. I actually forgot about abominations. Let's Tesla storm them. And hopefully this will kill them. Okay, let's try this. The, I think the abomination is the one enemy this bow doesn't kill in one shot. Because watch this. Hit the mangler once. That fire will kill him. Mangler's dead. We just might need to hit this abomination a few times. Actually, we don't even need to hit him at all. Technically, we can just run from him. But there's not a whole lot of room here to run. This is fucking scary. I'm not going to lie. I don't know how I'm going to survive this. I'm just shooting and praying that they fall over at least for a long enough time to stay away. Only got 20 seconds. 
Double points, too. If we can survive this, we're going to get good money. Oh, we did it. Ooh, that was close. That mimic was about to break my armor, too. Okay, we're doing things. Oh, I think our double points ran out just before we got rewarded. That's awful. Oh, wait, we still got 12,000. Oh, we're good. All right, let's get this to pack three. What? Oh, I need to get a pack two first. I'm an idiot. I was like, wait, what? Pack punch three is not unlocked yet? Guess we'll have to get to pack three on our next round. I'm just going to try to blaze through these. Does it still work? Past round five? It does not. Okay, we're on collateral now, which is my personal favorite outbreak map. I feel like it's the perfect size for an outbreak map. You can get across the whole area pretty easily. You can see basically everything from the top of the mountain. And normally the objectives on here aren't too bad. Plus, you can get Warda spawning, which I don't think he did, unless he's on the other side. Another Omega helicopter. Come on. There we go. Sniped it. Look at all this scrap. Now, if we find an armor stand, I don't quite remember where the armor stand is on this map because I know Wonderfizz is in there. I know Pack-a-Punch is up here. The crafting bench is like down here. I think armor might be on this side near our main objective. Oh, it's right here. Yeah, let's upgrade this right now. Stop, stop. No hitting. Okay, we're, we're actually getting prowled on right now. Okay, can I upgrade this without you guys getting on my ass? There we go. Gold, exit, no! Apparently I couldn't do it without them getting on my ass. Get over here and get electric cherry. Stop walking away. Come on. Don't make me waste my self revive. There we go. Oh no! I lost all my perks from that? Really? That's annoying. Not just annoying though, that's bad. That's not good for us. Not only that, is I don't have mule kick anymore, so I don't have my M79. We need to go grab jug, PhD, and mule kick right now. We're gonna need this discount. Okay, jug, PhD. Uh, mule kick. Elemental speed. Get out of the machine! Ooh. There we go. Our M79's back. Alright, I guess we're just gonna have to rock with this. Let's see if we can do our main event. Let's call it in. Okay! Alright! Dang! Already almost knocked me again! Relax! Zombies are no joke. Alright, go ahead and spawn in. I'm gonna eat this M79. It would be an abomination, wouldn't it? Looks pretty sweet though, I'm not gonna lie. Is this even doing anything to it? It's just kind of walking at me. Oh, here comes the laser. Duck behind the dune. Jeez. This thing just eats shots. Okay, armor's busted. Ooh. I'm about to be. I don't even have any stims anymore. Shit. No, no! Okay, I have to self-revive here. I don't have quick revive. I think we still kept mule kick and PhD. Those are our first two perks we picked up. Genius play by me. But no armor here is very bad. There we go. We broke one of its faces. Okay, that grapple gun money just saved us right there. That was kind of clean. What are you doing up there? You goober? Is that its health? The eliminate thing, is that its health? We've done nothing. Okay, chill. There's no more food around for me to grab. We just busted his face though. Busted on his face. Nutted in his mouth. Oh, it's going to teleport away. That was its first face. I forgot about this. Oh, it's already back here. This is like way, way, way harder than I thought it was going to be. Okay, we got it to half health after a half hour of fighting with it. Is anything dropping food? No, no. Grapple, go. <gasps> Spider-Man, bitch. Oh, yeah, you can jump. I forgot about that. No, 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 no. I got cornered. That is way harder than I thought it was going to be. But I guess take a look at our final stats. Only 586 kills, 140 crits, three downs. Overall, though, that was pretty fun. Way more difficult than I ever imagined it to be or even remembered it to be that was tough i forgot how fast things scale on outbreak i thought i could get away with skipping a few but but it seems like we are not good enough to get to double digits in survival outbreak i i think i will try this again though i, I like this kind of mode for outbreak it gives it more of an objective normal outbreak kind of seems like you're just going from event to event and not really doing anything it's just a longer version of round base but in in survival feels like you have to do a whole lot more anyways gonna end the video here uh thank you guys for watching you've uh, truly changed my life i am very grateful for all of you and i will see you in the next one goodbye